when it comes to apathy. <laughs> I just don't think I can continue to live in a place that embraces and nurtures apathy as if it was a virtue. You know different, you know better. I didn't say I was different or better. I'm not. Hell, I sympathize. I, I sympathize completely. Apathy is a solution. I mean, it's, it's easier to lose yourself in drugs than it is to cope with life. It's easier to steal what you want than it is to, to earn it. Yeah. It's easier to beat a child than it is to raise it. Help. Love costs, it takes effort and work. We are talking about people who are mentally ill. We are talking about people fucking crazy. No, no, yes. we're not. No, no. Today. We're, we're, we're talking about everyday life here.
the reason? I decided to go for a little run. So I ran to the end of the road. And when I got there, I thought maybe I'd run to the end of town. President Carter, suffering from heat exhaustion, fell into the arms And when I got there, I thought maybe I'd just run across Greenbow County. And I figured since I run this far, maybe I'd just run across the great state of Alabama. And that's what I did. I ran clear across Alabama. For no particular reason, I just kept on going. I ran clear of the ocean. Anyway, like I was saying, I had a lot of company. My mom always said, you got to put the past behind you before you can move on. And I think that's what my life was all about. I had run for three years, two months, 14 days and 16 hours. Dust to dust. <laughs>